Yeah, I didn't realize how low cribs are. Like, pretend you're putting a baby in, Matt. <laughs> That's not how you put a baby in. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got food expert Nicole Gonzalez here joining us. Thanks so much for being here. Welcome back to the vlog. Welcome back. This is a new day. Uh, so we are, is currently the weekend. We got a ton of packages delivered yesterday from Wayfair and Ikea. Um, so we're gonna be building some furniture. It's a little bit of a rainy day today, so we figured it's a good day to stay in and get some stuff done around the house. So today we're actually doing in the living room here. I know we haven't done like a full house tour, but it's because we're not done the house. I feel like we've done some rooms, but not a full one. So it still looks like very unfinished here as if we just moved in, I know. Um, the fireplace that we got from Costco, which you would have seen in our me telling Matt I'm pregnant video. <laughs> there it is. This is what it looks like on. Ah, I think that's gonna look so good in the living room, eh? Okay. This, I feel like helps tie the space a little bit better, um, but we still need shelves on either side. So I ordered these ladder bookshelf cases from Wayfair. I'll link them below. So we're gonna finally take this out. This annoys me so much. This is just like my self-care basket <laughs> for like when I do my workouts and stretching and all that. We're gonna do shelves on either side and we wanted ones that had an open back so you could still have the surround sound come through. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. So we got our boxes there. Matt's just gonna open them up and we're gonna we're gonna build some furniture. I can't remember, is Wayfair easier to assemble than Ikea? Uh, depends on the item, I think. So we're gonna, hopefully it doesn't take us more than an hour to actually set this up, but I thought I would just vlog it. So th today's video might be in two vlogs just cause we're not doing too much later today, but I want to show building these. Also the furniture we're gonna be building in the back is gonna be part of a separate vlog. It's like a small office makeover reno video that I wanna to put together because I have like some really cute ideas for that back room. Even though it's really small, I want it to be functional for when the baby comes and just have it as like a home office so I actually have some separation. So we are gonna be building that furniture too but it's gonna be part of a separate vlog. So today's will probably just be like mishmash with another vlog. Um, yeah, so we're gonna build some furniture and I don't know, I'm excited. I feel like I wanna be put to work, you know? So this is the color. No, I think this looks like a really nice walnut. Oh, fun fact, I hate styrofoam. Ugh, it's like nails on chalkboard to me. I think this is really nice. Okay, so we're gonna pull everything out of the boxes. I guess we'll do one at a time and see how this goes. <laughs> Wish us luck. Next, we'll be building a crib. <laughs> got her bone she's good so we got them all laid out on the floor so it's actually nice it matches our floor quite well and I think it's gonna really pop because the floors are really or sorry the walls are a lighter color hopefully it's pretty easy they're all labeled and stuff so we'll see would you say you're an instructions person oh yeah you gotta be <laughs> glue on them so you have to like them. Matt's putting me to work. 
And I was like, what can I do? <laughs> so I'm gonna look at my shelves and say that I built that pregnant. What the hell? Where is that coming from? <laughs> well, it's coming from probably the screws or the hex. What is black? What is this? All? Yeah, that's all black. Oh my God. I should not have worn a white shirt for this. <sighs> Cashew, you've come to help? You've come to help? Cashew is so interested in what's happening. She's like, what are you guys, what are you guys doing? What's happening? Why are, you guys, why are you guys hanging out over here? Are your dogs like this? They want to be involved in everything you do? Why are you crying? Where's your bone? Where's your bone? <laughs> oh, okay, okay. You have a bone. I don't know why you're crying. I'm just providing mostly moral support. I would say this is pretty easy to put together. It's just like a lot of screwing. Yeah. I would almost say it's, easier um, than Ikea. Would you say easier than Ikea furniture? Maybe. So, okay, we're gonna, I gotta get up. Yeah, we'll just put it on a, uh, a side. Getting up is a task these days. But you can see like the ladder shelf part on the side. Okay, so what are we doing now? That's not true. So apparently we messed up. What is it? This one is the wrong this board. Is the, longer, the longer screw on the top one. Oh, oh, it's just the wrong screw. Just the longer one. Oh, okay. That's all. It looks good. Oh, Matt's getting out the big guns. The drill. Sponsored by the Walt. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're gonna crack the wood. Mm, That's what every guy says. We'll see. You just want to use your power drill. So we just have these like sword looking things that are gonna go in the back. We actually forgot about them, they were still in the box. And Matt being the good daddy he is, he's like, we're gonna have to bolt this to the wall, baby safety. And this is what Cashew does all day. Cashew, I'm exploiting you and showing what you really do all day. What you really do all day, huh? She just lazes. Why don't you want your bone? Cause you're lazy? Okay. So TV's a little bit big. <laughs> No, TV is. So Matt's gonna start on the second shelf and I'm just gonna remove all of these like stickers. So I'm just gonna pull some stuff around the house and start styling it. But I'm really excited just to see like what I can just use from our house and just add some more greenery on here. I think this pothos is gonna look really cute when it starts to trickle down. So I'm just gonna play around. It might look completely different, but I'm gonna see what I have. I also just went downstairs to the shop and picked up some, I went shopping downstairs, picked up some of our new home goods and they're just so cute. Like we have all these like white ceramic pieces. So I just picked up a couple of different options to see if they'll work on the shelves, but I think I'll just add some nice pops of white and then I can maybe add some like faux flowers to these or something. I just think they're so cute. So I've just been pulling like random stuff throughout the house that I might be able to style the shelves with. I have some picture frames with some photos in them. I, we actually need to print some more photos. It's like one of my 
was on my vision board this year and I still need to do it. And then yeah, I just got some like random stuff uh, that I can style and put on. That was just to water the plant. Matt is doing good with the second shelf. Good job, Matt. <laughs> He's been like swearing at this thing. It's like the smallest Allen key ever for the whole thing. So, and then we'll get rid of that and then I'll finish. I think like it'll be easier to style them when I have both of them together so I can make sure it's like well balanced. I really have no idea what I'm doing with the shelves. I'm not an interior designer, so I'm just gonna kind of eyeball it and see what looks good. And really it's just a good way to utilize like finding space for things that I have lying around the house, especially since we're trying to free up stuff from the guest room, AKA the nursery room. Um, this is perfect. So I probably want to end up getting like some baskets and stuff to store some stuff. So it's not just like pretty, but it's actually useful and it helps save some space, but we'll see what it looks like when it's done. Wish me luck. I feel like I say that every time, but for real, wish me luck. I have no idea what I'm doing. straighten the TV. So we're just positioning things a bit better. We moved over the fireplace. I lined up that shelf with the speaker. Wow. That one looks really good with the natural light coming through. Looks good. For Walmart vacuums, I'm taking a little fa break because you gotta eat, you gotta eat. <laughs> So I just did a little Pinteresting and I just was looking up like how to style bookshelves. So there's some ideas that I'm gonna get. I guess there's like some rules and guidelines to it to make it look good. So I'm gonna see if I have stuff. Like I'll probably have to go to HomeSense or something to get a few more pieces, but I just wanna try and use like what I have here so far and just see how it looks. Here. We were just gonna order stuff and have it sent to the house, but last night when I was trying to do the delivery It was saying only pickup so and then a couple of items weren't actually available for delivery at all like I don't know It was really confusing. So we're just like, you know what? It's really hot today. There's like heat warning We did go on a morning hike before it got too hot, but it's really hot right now So we figured Ikea is a good little adventure to do today because we can walk around inside with the AC and when you are six months pregnant it gets really hot if you like overheat. At least I do. She's she's a little furnace. So we are basically picking up a mixture of things for some stuff for the back office that we're working on, a dresser for the baby's room. I 
thought I was gonna do like a six drawer dresser from Urban Outfitters that was like three times the price, um, but it turns out it's too big. We have to do a smaller version of the dresser because the, the room is quite small that's gonna be the nursery. So Matt's pretty happy about that because uh, he likes saving money, right Matt? Love saving money. He's like, oh, it's not gonna fit. We'll have to do the smaller one. <laughs> <laughs> that's exactly what happened, so. We are gonna just hopefully see it in person. It's a really cute dresser and I think it's gonna match the crib that I want like perfectly. I think they're both like birch, like a light birch wood. Like a birch. Like a birch. So Maybe we're gonna get that. It. Twerk like a birch. Twerk like a birch. So anyways, we're gonna do that and uh, see what else they have. I need like baskets and stuff and you know, all that fun stuff. I feel like Ikea is like Costco. You go in there thinking you just need a couple things and then you end up with all these little knickknacks. So to Ikea we go. Matt forgot his nice reusable mask. I gotta wear this one. And he keeps bugging me about bringing mine. So we're in Ikea. Same, same, but different. <laughs> but I'm finding a few, few of the things that I'm looking for and some new things. So I think it's gonna be a successful trip. Ooh, so this is the dresser that we're looking for. Easy, there, Tiger. Well, it gets, it's like, it gets stuck. Oh, I like that it has the... Yeah, get stuff. I like that it has the slow. That's cute. So I guess it comes with the tassels. We don't have to buy them. We're in the baby section. So this is how we shop. Matt's on his phone ordering furniture that can be delivered to the house from here. Uh, actually, one of the, the dresser that we just saw isn't actually available. Um, so we have to order it online. So he that's why he's on the phone all the time when I'm shopping. He's checking for good, better deals, he's ordering stuff so we don't have to carry it to the car. Uh, but we're gonna pick up like all the smaller things in store. Oh, little dollhouse. That's a very basic one. Matt says there's cribs over here. Don't you wish I would just get this one that's only $100? <laughs> yeah, I didn't realize how low cribs are. Like, pretend you're putting a baby in, Matt. <laughs> you put a baby in. <laughs> so it was a successful trip because this is the desktop I need that was back ordered to August. So we got that and then we got just a few other things, but mostly ordered online. And then Matt wants to try these. They're pickled. like pickled mushroom chips. And I got two bags of their meatballs because they're so good. And I also got this cute little trio cactus, cacti planter. But I think it was successful. Super successful. Right? I'm, I'm just happy that we got that. Note to self, don't wear flats to Ikea. My feet feel so sore. Oh, oh my God, that was a mission. Quite the mission. I'll look at something in my eye. Okay, we're gonna try these chips. I'm just gonna try the gummies. Mmm. Gooseberry, apple, or pear? Gooseberry. I think that was pear. I don't even know what gooseberry tastes like. You know this smells like? You know like the Mr. Noodle mushroom cactus? Like this instant ramen mix? <laughs> Weird. Yeah, tastes like Mr. Noodle. Is that good or bad? I mean, I'm hungry. It's 3 o'clock and I haven't had lunch yet. We thought their little cafeteria would be open. Nope. This is one for coffee. They're okay. It sounded interesting. I prefer salt and vinegar chips. Yeah, not bad. They don't have a lot of flavoring. Yeah. Like you could all you could all more pickle. You could almost eat it and think it was just like. Just like a regular chip, like a plain regular. Yeah. Right? I kind of wish there was more. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. I wish there was more like sourness to it, like the pickle. Mmm, pickle. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna try and pack some food. Also, it's like 40 degrees outside today. It's really hot. 
It is me from the future. I wanted to actually end the vlog because I forgot to. Uh, shelves look so good. I'm so happy with them. I'm just waiting on some wicker baskets, as I mentioned. Um, I think I ordered them from Westham, and they're not gonna be here, I think, until September. They're just on back order, but I think they're gonna really fill up the empty space and just provide more storage, so I'm really excited for those. Uh, thank you so much, guys, for watching today's vlog. Honestly, I just feel like Every week we're just trying to prep things around the house. It's honestly been so much fun just to guys, just to kind of bring you guys along while we get things done around the house, get ready for the arrival of baby Acorn. I feel like she's coming just around the corner and there's still a few things I wanna get done in the house. Um, one of them being, of course, the nursery. That's next on the list. We're just about done the back office and it's looking so good. I can't wait to share that room with you guys. Um, but yeah, if you guys liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps support my channel and don't forget to subscribe for more weekly videos. I post here every single week. It's free to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Have a fabulous day and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye guys. <laughs>